What is going on, family? What's going on, guys? Thomas here, Tominator, aka the Bread Daddy, aka Tominator. Anyways, guys, what I want to talk to you about really quickly today are the 100 day challenges that I created um, the squat for 100 days straight and the hip thrusts for 100 days straight, and basically just why I created them uh, because I've been getting a few questions and I just want to kind of address it. So, First things first, if you don't know, you can check out the free challenges. You can go to my website and go to thomasmichaelpera.ca um, or also on my Instagram at thomasmichaelpera. Um, in my story highlights, there's the template. There's the story highlight that says templates. And there is what you will find is the 100 days straight on squats and the uh, meat rocket day, meat, meat rockets and the 100 days on uh, hip thrust. Now, for those of you who don't know, when I say, when I talk of a leg day, I call it a meat rocket day, building the meat rockets, um, and, I, and then I generally slap my legs because those are the meat rockets, so you're waking them up. But anyways, that's why you'll find the hashtag meat rockets on the um, squat template, and that's why you'll find a Paramount Physique Peach hashtag on the 100 days straight on thrusts because uh, we're growing the peach. Anyways, what I'm trying to say is why, because yes, it's a physical, obviously, challenge, uh, but it has it really has nothing to do with um, growing bigger meat rockets or growing a bigger peach, even though, I mean, everyone would love both of those, but um, what it's about really is why is it a hundred days uh, and basically it comes down to um, you know when was the last time you did a challenge and you stuck to it right so this is a challenge that if you can't make it to the gym you can do your squats at home you can do your hip thrusts at home they don't have to be you know, waited in the gym every single day. It's about getting it done no matter what. It's about adapting when life comes, when appointments happen, when things change, and people fall off of their goals to themselves. Um, this is all about sticking to it no matter what. It's about adapting. So when you're at the gym, do your squats at the gym. If you can't make it to the gym for whatever reason, then pick a number at home and do 50 bodyweight squats whenever you're at home and you can't make it to the gym. If you can't make, if you're not going to the gym, then all of your squats will be at home. But no matter what, you get them done because that's what it's about. It's about building the habits and the self-trust in yourself, um, finishing things that you say you're going to start, um, and then building that trust with yourself that you know you can go the distance because a lot of the reason why anyone doesn't start, doesn't make goals or take on challenges is because they think there's a chance that they might fail. If you knew that you would never fail any challenge or any goal, then why wouldn't we just set fucking goals left and right and center and just keep banging out goals every day, every week, every month, every year? You would, right? So what this is gonna do is teach you to trust yourself to know that no matter what the challenge is, no matter what goal you set, no matter what it is, that you know you can go the distance. It's all about building that mindset, building those habits, building that mentality, and has really nothing to do with building the meat rockets or the peach. Um, those are byproducts, okay? Those are byproducts of the habits that you're forming. So, you know, that's the gist of it, basically. I could, I could talk about this forever. Um, if you want to know more, you can comment down below in the comment section. Uh, I can answer questions there. Um, there is a full glute guideline description for the thrusts, 100 days on thrusts, and 100 days of um, on, on, on squats for the meat rockets. There's the full descriptions on laid out on how you should follow the program. Um, I've done them myself. I'm currently on about day 50 on the thrusts. Um, I well squatted over 100 days, all in the gym, all over 225. Most of it was over 225 pounds or, or up. Um, because I wouldn't ask you to do something that I haven't done myself to test it out. And I'm currently 
uh, doing another trial run test thing for another challenge program that I'm going to be putting together um, to continue just the habits and continue to building, you know, the best bodies that we can that we want. Um, you know, because everyone I think in general wants to be, you know, fit and feeling good and feeling good naked. So anyways, I'm rambling on. Um, yeah, so like I said, you got any question, comment below. Um, hit the subscribe button if you want to, if you like this content, hit the like button if you like this content, share this video with somebody um, who maybe you want to do the challenge with. Um, you can check it out on my website, like I said, at thomasmichaelpera.ca. Um, link will be in the description, as well as on my social media, at thomasmichaelpera on Instagram. It's the same on Facebook. It's the same on all platforms. Um, and I think that's it, guys. So I just want to say thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. Thank you for stopping by. And I'll catch you soon or later. I gotta go do my thrusts. No, actually, I did them. <laughs> but stay tuned. A lot of real cool stuff coming out um, on this channel, through the website, through Instagram. We are just getting started, guys. So we, I'll catch you sooner than later. It's time for my work walk. It's beautiful outside right now. I'm gonna go for my walk. Anyways, I'm out. I love it. Ciao.